Hey everyone, so in today's video, I'm going over nine top artificial intelligence tools that will boost your income and change your life. Now, if you guys haven't heard already, AI is super in and for a good reason. Uh, Alicia, I've always been sort of a, a science nerd my whole life. And this chatbot talked about feeling sorry for one of the characters. Tonight, we're taking a deep dive into the world of AI with a special focus on chat GPT. There are so many cool tools popping up that take advantage of neural learning and have implemented properly, this can save you so much time and allow you to do so many cool things. For example, I can use it to change my voice. I can use AI to narrate this video. We can use AI to instantly take notes of our meetings, help us with our grammar, and even edit amazing photos. So I've done the research. These are my nine favorite AI tools right now, and I'm super excited to share them with you. Let's get started. Now, this first tool we're talking about today is gonna allow you to do AI voiceovers. If you're making commercials, content such as a faceless YouTube channel, as well as many other different uses, this is gonna help you out a lot. So the tool is called Murph AI and basically allows you to convert text into speech with these AI voice generators. So I'm here in the Murph studio. And let me show you quickly how awesome this is. We'll click plus here, name it test project. Let's say we want to create an audiobook, and we'll click create project right here. Here we'll enter in some text. So now that we have that, we can actually choose who we want to actually say this. A lot of these require the pro plan, but we'll select someone that doesn't require that. Let's say we want to go with Ryan. We can change the pitch as well as the speed if we want. So that's going to generate the audio. And once that's done, and let me click play and hopefully you guys can hear it. This is my audio book that covers topics in social media marketing, copywriting, and more. So it sounds pretty good. So let's choose Sophie. Let's generate the audio there and let's see what this sounds like. This is my audiobook that covers topics on social media marketing, copywriting, and more. So I think it sounds pretty good. Of course, it's not perfect. It's not gonna be as good as hiring an actual voiceover artist, but for a free AI tool, this is pretty amazing. We can build out a whole timeline within the Murph studio. We can import a script if we want. We can add media, we can do a voice changer. And yeah, tons of different things that you guys can do with this tool. All right, so the next tool that we're talking about right now is gonna be called Talk to Books. This is a free tool that Google provides us and it basically allows you to browse passages from books using AI. So let me show you guys how this works. Let's say I want to create a video or a blog post about cold therapy. I want to reference a bunch of different books and this is actually going to be one of the best ways to do that. I actually do this with a lot of my YouTube videos and it's a super, super cool way to use AI to do research. So let's search up cold therapy right here. We'll click go and it's going to look through a bunch of different books and find passages that include that keyword cold therapy. If we keep scrolling, you guys can see there's tons and tons of different passages from numerous books and textbooks and things like that. And if you want to view it in the book, we can actually click on this and it'll take you to the section where that actually is. We can also search up something like best morning routine. This is going to bring up a bunch of different books that talk about morning routines. It's going to show you the passage. And of course, like before, we can actually view it within the book to get some more context. And yeah, this is just amazing for doing research. It's super cool that we literally have access to you know millions of different books all through this AI search tool called talk to books. If you're having trouble finding sources for different things that you want to talk about, this is going to be the perfect tool for you. So next we have a neural writing tool called chat GPT. You guys may have heard of this. It's super, super cool. But essentially this tool is going to be able to write anything you want for you. It can also sort of act as like a Google. So instead of searching something up on Google, you can actually just search it up here on chat GPT. It's going to crawl through all the data and basically write out a summary of the answer you're looking for. So I'm in ChatGPT right here. And let me just show you some of the cool use cases for this tool. Let's say we want to write an article about why working out is good for you. So basically what we can do is type in, write why working out is good for you. Right, so let's do that. It's going to generate this in real time. And you guys can see within a matter of seconds, it's written out this pretty well-researched paragraph or article about why working out is good for you. Of course, this is not gonna be the end all tool, especially if you're actually publishing these articles, right? I recommend just using this as a starting place. It's gonna help you do a lot of research. And after this, you can actually go through it, edit it yourself or have someone do that for you. AI also cannot make sure that all the facts that are contained within the article are perfectly correct. So you'll want to fact check as well. But yeah, as you can see, this is a really great starting point. And at any point, you can also click regenerate response Response, it's going to create a completely different block of text for you. And you can basically pick and choose from different ones. This is also super fun. You can make ChatGPT literally write you letters. So for example, we can click this and it's going to generate a letter just based on that prompt. It can be super creative. I'm pretty blown away by how well it can write. And yeah, there's just so many applications with 
tool like this because writing is everywhere. And if you can use a tool like this to increase your efficiency, putting out content, then well, that's going to save you and make you a lot more money. So next up is gonna be a tool that actually can analyze your Excel and Google Sheets docs. This is actually built into Excel and Google Sheets, but it's a feature that not a lot of people know about. So right here, I have a spreadsheet with some fake data that I put in. So we have item and we have four items right here. We have revenue in January as well as profit. So basically what we can do with this data is we'll come here to the explore button. And that's going to open up this explore tab over here. Now this data is super, super simple and basic. If I were to have a lot more columns and more intricate data, then the stuff over here would be actually really cool. But as you guys can see, it's created a bunch of different graphs and charts and things like that for us to actually analyze this data. Here's created a chart showing us the revenue per product as well as the profit. This is pretty cool. We can click here to insert this chart into the actual sheet, or we can actually view it in full size by clicking clicking on this. Here's a different view for that same chart. It looks pretty good. And yeah, the really cool part about this is that we can actually ask Google Sheets about this data. So for example, we can ask something like total profit. It's gonna add those things up for us and we can see the answer is 17,000. We can also ask it something like which item has the highest profit. We can also ask it things like total revenue in January. It's going to sum up those numbers for us and the answer is $68,500. And yeah, this data is super, super simple. If I had cooler data, you'd be able to ask it a lot more questions. And yeah, this is just a super cool tool that you guys can use within Google Sheets or Excel. And it should save you a lot of time if you're trying to analyze data. Next up is this really cool tool called Fireflies AI. Fireflies basically helps automate your meeting notes. And it's like this little bot that you invite to your calls and it's going to take notes for you and organize all the different data. So this is our website. We can scroll down here to see some of the things that it actually does. So you guys can see it automatically records and transcribes meetings. And essentially how it works you basically just invite the fireflies.ai note taker to your meetings and it's going to automatically join and generate all those things for you automatically. Another really great thing is that you can actually find anything with their AI powered search. So yeah, we can see action items, we can see different tasks, questions that were asked, as well as other key metrics. We can also sort by different key topics that were talked about. You can also analyze your meetings so you can see, you know, how long each person talked for, the overall sentiments, identify objections, competitors. And yeah, just a super, super cool tool that I personally have not really used, but I have a lot of friends that use Fireflies. I see the fireflies.ai note taker in our calls. And when I see that, I know, okay, this meeting is getting notes taken and I don't necessarily have to take notes myself. I can just ask for those notes later on. And yeah, it just makes your life a lot easier. The next AI tool we're talking about is a picture editing tool called Luminar AI. Okay, so I have a picture here pulled up in Luminar AI. And I'm basically gonna show you how we can use AI to transform this pretty basic photo of myself. I basically do this for my YouTube thumbnails and it doesn't make your picture pop. And it's super cool because AI has a lot of cool things it can do for your photo that you otherwise would not think about doing. So the first thing I'm gonna do is come here to edit and I'll come here to structure. It's gonna use this AI tool to create some more depth in this photo. We can boost it as well. We can also use it to create some more saturation as well as vibrance. Yeah, there's a lot of other things you guys can do here. For example, there's the enhance AI tool. If you guys also have photos with a sky, you can use this to change out the sky. It's really, really cool. But I'll come here to portrait and what I'm gonna do is go to face AI. We're gonna use this to light up my face more. You can also use it to slim your face if you want. Let's say we want to do that a little bit. For your eyes, we can use their AI eyes tool to basically, you know, increase our iris visibility. We can enlarge the eyes if we want a little bit. We can whiten the eyes also, enhance the eyes with this, remove any red eye. We can also improve our eyebrows. For your mouth, you can, you know, change up the saturation, the redness and all that stuff. I think the eyes are a little bit overdone here, but I just sort of want to show you guys how you can use this tool. Same thing, they have a skin AI tool as well. We can remove remove the shine using this, as well as any skin defects. And yeah, they also have a ton of cool templates that we can apply to this photo. I'm not really gonna go over these, but the point is they have so many cool AI tools within this program. And I definitely think it can transform your photos if that is something that you do. So yeah, this is a weird edit. I know the eyes look weird. I'll probably bump these all down a little bit just so that it's not so weird. But yeah, really easy and cool way to use AI to edit your images. The next tool we're talking about is a really cool AI grammar tool. And it's basically gonna help you write a lot better. You guys may have heard of Grammarly. This is pretty similar to it, but this is a really cool free 
Chrome extension that you guys can install. And every time you write a sentence, you can basically highlight it and it's going to show you other different ways of saying that same phrase. So I'm here on the website and uh, you guys can sort of get a feel for what a word tune can do by typing something here and seeing what it's going to uh, show you. So let's say I write this, we can click rewrite and it's going to show you a bunch of different ways of saying this. So if you guys are trying to learn English or if you're just trying to word your sentences better, I mean, the way I wrote this is not very good. As you guys can see, it recommends this, which is actually a lot better. It's a lot more clear and sounds better. And yeah, if you guys are typing a lot or you're writing a lot. This is going to be a very, very helpful tool. It's completely free. And yeah, the last thing we want to do is write sentences that don't make sense, especially if it's in a professional setting. So a tool like this can really help weed out those weird sentences and train you to write a lot better. So the next tool we're talking about is going to use AI to help with your content marketing. It's called Neural Text. I have it pulled up right here. And yeah, something like this is basically going to help you automate your whole content operations. You can sort of view it as an all-in-one content marketing platform. And of course, that's going to save you a lot of money as well as a lot of time. So here we can see some of the different use cases for neural text. For example, let's say we are trying to write something. Let's say how to eat a healthy diet. Let's click generate. And that's basically going to generate a paragraph on this subject, right? So this is pretty similar to chat GPT. And yeah, the best part about this is that it really does cut down on the research time. You can also use it for a content outline. So basically you'll write an article title and this tool is going to generate an outline for your content. For example, let's write best retirement accounts. Generate. This is really cool because it's basically going to do the research for you and create this outline. And from this outline, we have a bunch of different talking points. So if you're doing a video like this, I can see that being extremely helpful. They also have something, for example, uh, helping you write product descriptions where you basically write in your product name as well as some keywords and it's going to generate a product description. So I've input some stuff here. Let's click generate. And you can see it, it wrote something for us here. Probably not going to be the best final product description that you'll end up using, but it's a great starting point. You can also use it to do organic competitor research as well as a bunch of other things. Overall, if you're creating content, this is going to be a game changing tool for you. So anyways, I hope you guys got some value out of this video. Every single resource that we mentioned in this video is going to be down below in the description. And yeah, I think if you get creative with using these tools, it can really make your life a lot easier as well as make you more money. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button and also support the channel by subscribing. We do a ton of videos about personal finance, entrepreneurship, and investing. Thank you so much for your time and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.